Here's a controversial one. You should do more things that could potentially get you fired. The reason why I say this is everyone is playing it safe in this world. And no one's taking the risk to stand out, make a difference. But in order to be living a very interesting life, one where you're changing the world, you need to do things that could potentially get you fired. Now, I say POTENTIALLY in all caps here, because if you do things that WILL get you fired, and you can look up what those are, but they're really obvious. Like, you ask yourself, will I get fired? Yes. Like, if you can say yes to that, then you probably shouldn't do that. I'm, I'm saying, if you do this, could you, could you get in trouble if somebody found out? Um, and would it actually get you fired? Or is it just, like, this potential that you could? Not an automatic firing, right? Oh, this is going to be a controversial discussion here. Because, obviously, if you've got bills to pay, you're sort of in that play it safe category. Like, you'll never really go beyond that. But if you have the ability to take risks, to take chances, to, to do things outside of your comfort zone, you should do those at the risk of getting in trouble. This is how companies grow is having more employees who are willing to take those risks, who are willing to break the cycle, okay? And even if somebody decides that they're going to fire you, you have a good thing to mention on your resume in that you took a risk to help try to grow the company. That is going to work well for you. The idea of just doing the 9 to 5 isn't enough. You need to have unique ideas. You need to bring fresh perspectives to the table. You need to say what you think at the risk of doing something different. Now you know what will get you fired, but potentially that that's going to make you indispensable you know you might get fired at that job but someone else will hire you for your bright ideas don't ever feel stifled from doing and sharing and exploring and pushing your boundaries because that in itself will help push the boundaries of the company and most companies want to grow but they don't want to have staff who are willing to take the risks at the end of the day. They, they do want to kind of structure things in, in a sort of a bucket area. It's your job to break through and show why the risks are worthwhile. What other things can I suggest here? Uh, Instead of thinking of a wild idea of how to promote a company and not telling anyone, make sure you get the point across to your superior that you got this bright idea and let's try it out. At the risk of completely derailing what it is you're doing at the job, it's worthwhile to mention it. If you think there's so much of a status quo at the job, change it up. Throw it up in the air and swing a bat at it and create something wholly different. Entirely different. Entirely in a different direction. Take it. Go for it. See what happens. Start asking the question, will this potentially get me fired? And it, You know, you have to be able to laugh at it. Like, yeah, it could potentially get me fired, but it's a good idea. Then go with it, right? Just make sure you don't do the stupid things that are really obvious. 
I'll leave that all up to you and how to figure that out. But I just thought I'd create this, I don't know, as a unique way of thinking for employees.